Hey folks, Aaron at Redbird Speed. Today I want to talk about how to vent your rear end. So when you get this housing from Mosier, it's going to be drilled and tapped on the top of the tube, a couple inches in from the center. No matter what rear end you get, they're going to drill and tap a hole in the top right there. And they're going to provide this brass fitting with the hardware packet. So that will come in a yellow envelope with the uh, your center section studs, your T-bolts, and that type of hardware whenever you get a housing. So uh, this is drilled and tapped, ready to put this brass fitting in here. What Mosier recommends doing is running a hose. So go to your hardware store, get a piece of hose, get a clamp, secure that up in the chassis so the rear end can breathe. So the reason you're going to do that is so it doesn't build pressure. So a couple, probably the two main causes for leaking are going to be not having it ventilated properly. You want to make sure there's no kinks in that line. Uh, if there's a kink in that line and it's not building pressure, if it's pinched somewhere, it could build pressure up and blow a seal out. Um, another cause would be overfilling with gear oil. So it's probably most rear ends going to take somewhere around two and a half quarts of gear oil, depending on what you're working on. Uh, don't want to make you want to make sure it's not filled up past the plug in the side of the center section case. So uh, usually most people send out you know two or three quarts of fluid, uh, depending on what rear end you have and you're going to use on this specific rear end probably around two and a half quarts so um, keep that in mind if you're if you're blowing these seals out on the housing ends or this, this pinion seal on the front here of your differential of your center section if you're blowing those seals out and you're trying to figure out what's going on you probably have some kind of pressure issue the majority of the time it's going to be overfilled with fluid or it's going to be a ventilation issue so if you have any questions on this, give us a call 260 301 2424. You can get us at redbirdspeed.com. Drop a comment below. We appreciate your support. Be sure to like and subscribe. Have a good day.